just click the button. Click the button and it's done. Your fate is in the hands of the application board, not in your hands, not your problem. How can something as tiny as a button have so much value? The button might as well say, click here and wave your right to have control over your future. And also, have fun stressing over getting into our school with a 6.3% acceptance rate loser. At least it's over. It's definitely not over. The stress still resides in my head. I feel like I can't relax. Totally and utterly paralyzed in this stress. Jesus Christ, can this stop already? I've already spent all day stressing, mulling over little details and thinking, thinking. Can I stop with the thinking already? My thoughts are completely suffocating me. Yale acceptance letters are supposed to come out Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. If they come out Friday, I have 82 hours left, but if they come out Saturday, I have 106 hours left. And if they come out Sunday, God, that's 130 hours I'll go without knowing the most life-changing information. If I don't get in, I'll guess I'll have to get a job. I'm wondering if the coffee shop on Favreau is still hiring. It's a good walk, but I'm still living with my parents. And what stops me from living with them forever? No college, no independence, no real life. I'll become sad, lonely. I'll work several medium wage jobs because the high paying jobs go to people who go to college. I'll never sleep. Never hang out with friends, never get a break, never excel, never succeed. I'll stay in the same stagnant spot for the rest of my life. All of my friends will feel bad for me and I'll constantly get pitiful looks and reminders of what could have been and... Hey, hey, you are drinking. Could I even survive if I don't get in? I mean, the thought of college has burned into my brain since almost elementary school. College is just something you have to do, an indispensable part of life. It's an experience, an experience everyone should have, right? Well, if I don't have that experience and everyone else does, how do I compete with that? Yeah, sure, I know the other applicants for the job have Ivy League schools backing them, but hey, once I got rejected by Yale, no way. Sweep your hair into the front now. Just, Yale letters got in today. Did you get yours? No, that's um, actually why I'm...
stressing out. Well, if you didn't get in, Yale doesn't deserve you. Yeah, one of the top five colleges doesn't deserve me. No matter what, it'll be okay. Yeah, whatever. Action. Remember Jimmy Newback? That kid a little bit older than me that was like mom's friend's son? Yeah. He was president of Coding Club. His community outreach program, star player on his tennis team, got straight A's, and he got an above average SAT score. He didn't get into a single college his senior year. What? Yeah, but you know what he did do? What'd he do? He survived. He got a job working with his dad, and now he's taking community college classes. He's actually happy and rethinking his whole career right now. He told me at Margot's party that he was so stressed out during the application process, but now he's the happiest he's ever been. Whatever happens, we'll figure it out. College is not everything. The application is not everything. Yale is not everything. What matters is that you're happy. Hey, everything is gonna be okay. Trust me, okay? Course. Stop. That was like the first that time we never hugged. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think we did a pretty good job there. You ready? Yeah. So what's for this? I don't know. What do you want? Okay, stop. <laughs> okay, stop. Congratulations. Yale University uh, inform you accepted.